Hello everybody! Today we will compare uh, three devices. It's Pocketbook 602 Pro, Kindle third generation and Sony PRS650. And we're starting with displaying the same file on all of them. It is just one page PDF file with different shades. I've loaded several files to check how they'd deal with them and we can just go through all of them. PDF has, um, or rather Pocketbook has two different viewers for PDFs and somehow one of them gives mistake when the other wouldn't. That's another one page uh, test file. Now we would load big uh, 36 megabyte uh, picture PDF file. Here it does the same thing. It o o gives us mistake. We have to hold on to start the right PDF viewer. All right. This is a huge file, so we'll try to page through it and see which one of them gonna page faster. Um, as far as handling picture PDF files, we have different options on the three devices. For Kindle, we have option uh, to change uh, rotation of the screen or to zoom into it. If we zoom, we will have to scroll um, the page from uh, left to right on up and down to see the whole page. If we change rotation, uh, we would have half the page, but it would be bigger, like that. As far as on Pocketbook, this function is handled by either Zoom, which we would have an um, option to either view many pages at once, fit widths, fit the whole page and we have different uh, zooming abilities there or do a text review. For this file it wouldn't be able to do text um, reflow because it's just uh, a picture file. But we can pick fit widths and do the same thing as far as the orientation. The orientation button is different from the zoom. And we have to pick which way we're going to orient it. And for the Sony, we can also uh, change orientation or here we can try picking different size or change different page board. It's the same as Pocketbook. It has either several pages change to cut off the margins or uh, to feed the page.
and I'll move them all in the original orientation so that we'll keep ch checking different things. Oh, I forgot to change orientation here, so let me change it here. And as far as pocketbook, let me change orientation there as well. And next time we would load the 15 megabyte uh, PDF file of uh, text, which is reflowable. Page through them and see how they'll page it. Now for reflowable PDF files we can um, do reflow but only on um, Pocketbook or Sony. If we can do reflow that means that we can change the size of the uh, text. like that or here we wouldn't be able to reflow we still have an option to zoom but that would make our page to be blown up and we'll have to drag it up and down and left to right now we can go back to home screen and just pick regular not very big file to read and see how they go through that one this is um, a pub file with built-in uh, fonts and here there well of course this is EPUB so Kindle is struck out it can't read EPUB files so instead we can just open let's say one of the books from uh, the Russian books we have there and see how they would go through that. that should give you impression how they compare in uh, speed we can uh, look on their different options as far as handling internet or uh, handling um, different functions of reading um, but here we reached our time limit i hope that would help in your choices uh, thank you for watching uh, goodbye